Ding dong, bing bong, welcome back to Sully Makes Poor Financial Decisions. It is everyone's favorite time of your Christmas time, and with Christmas time comes my favorite thing in the world. Free gifts! Growing up, I always did advent calendars counting down the days till Christmas. Every day you would open up a little square and it would have a chocolate inside. It was fantastic. But little did I know that there was an entire market out there of hundreds, if not thousands, of really stupid advent calendars. So I thought, what better way to ring in the holiday season than by spending a couple hundred bucks on useless things that I don't need. And look at this beautiful table of advent calendars we have, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, I'm so excited. It's like Christmas came early. All right, where do we start? Let's go with the mini brands advent calendar. So there are 24 minis included, but only five of them are surprises. Those five surprises must be awesome. What is it? It's, it's Hershey's chocolate syrup. Oh, it's adorable. I, it's so stupid. I love it. There's no chocolate in it. I'm very disappointed. Got some Kool-Aid bursts, delicious. Blue is the best flavor of any candy, don't at me. This just feels like product placement with more steps and less monetary incentive. I swear, I'm not getting paid to promote any of these products. I feel like I should be. I'm just an idiot and I'm doing this for free. Guys, there's a message inside this one. I think it's just a catalog of every item you could get. I really hope I get the bleach. That's what I want for Christmas. There's something in there, and I feel like we should figure that out. Let's crack this thing open. Ah, it's, it's a little piece of styrofoam. I love it. The 23rd, this is my birthday here, so I have high hopes for this one. Oh my god, I actually got laundry detergent on my birthday! Yes, down the hatch! <laughs> Guys, last day before Christmas, put your bets in, what's it gonna be? Oh, I love it! It's a blue icy. <laughs> Refreshing. All right, I now have like 24 little pieces of plastic that I'll end up losing eventually. I think it's time to move on to the next one. Unironically, I'm kind of excited about this one. With my OCD and my stress levels, I kind of love fidget toys, so this one might be a home run. I might have to retitle this video from dumb advent calendars to advent calendars that Sully loves. Number one. God, it's stuck. I'm never gonna get my first day of Christmas. How do you even get it out of here? I got it. What is it? I don't know what it is, but all I know is it's falling apart. Does it bounce? It doesn't bounce. All right, this one says you have to put it in water and let it sit for four hours. I'll go get some water. All right, I got water. All righty then. All right, well, let those sit while I unpackage the rest of these. On to five. I have no idea what this is. At this point, I'm convinced they're just finding whatever they have left around the warehouse and packaging it up. Like, what is this even supposed to be? It's, it's fun, I guess. Numero six. It's a horse, I guess, but it's long. <laughs> Do they just give me slime? It is slime. Oh, I love it. Ew. Welcome back to Sully ASMR. I hate it. Oh, okay. It's like one of those chickens you launch. Ooh. It's great. Even more balls. Just what I wanted. You are 16. Going on 17. It's a cube. Oh, ooh, that is... Oh my gosh, that... I... I don't know how I'm doing this, but it's extremely satisfying. Oh, another plastic ball. Ooh. All right, that's good. So it's like fidget spinner meets soccer ball. Classic. Oh my gosh. Oh, ew, ah! Oh, I hate it. Oh, it's so gross, ew, ah! All right, this one's made out of foam. Does this one bounce? It doesn't bounce. Oh, the final day of fidget toys. Got your classic fidget spinner. What a way to go out. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a there is so much crap on my desk right now. I wanted to get at least one chocolate advent calendar, so I bought this one. Huh? Seems a little thin to have chocolate. I don't know, I still have hope though. Number one, the people who walked in darkness have seen a great light, Isaiah 9-1. Is this seriously just Bible verses? The angel Gabriel was sent from God to a virgin betrothed to a man named Joseph, and the virgin's name was Sully. All right, what did I miss on the Amazon listing? All right, all right, that one's my bad. In no place does it say it has chocolate in it. I'm just an idiot. This one just says, and now a word from our sponsor. Well, today's sponsor is Established Tire. I'm kidding, it's not. Don't kill me. Today's sponsor is actually FlexiSpot. They just sent me their FlexiSpot Pro Plus Standing Desk E7 so I can finally revamp my editing setup. When you compare the E7 to other standing desks on the market right now, it is clear that FlexiSpot is giving you one of the best and most affordable products out there. This desk has a motorized height adjustment system so you can easily change the height of 
of the desk to fit your needs. The premium keypad on the desk has multiple presets so you can switch between your preferred heights with ease, and the desk itself can hold well over 300 pounds. The desk was actually super easy to set up all by myself, and seeing as I spend most of my life sitting here in front of a computer, this desk is a lifesaver because I can finally get up out of my chair and still get all my work done. But I'm not done yet! If you use the link in the description, FlexiSpot will automatically give you $30 off your first purchase. So go get yourself a new desk, and big thanks to FlexiSpot for sponsoring this video. Oh, let's check in on these things. Oh, they're growing, everyone. Look, it's the Forbidden Boba Tea. All right, so everyone knows the age-old debate is Die Hard a Christmas movie. I'm not here to fight about that. I bought this product because I absolutely loved the gruesome and broken English product description they had for it. Watching Hans Gruber fell from the Nakatomi Plaza for 24 consecutive days. It seemed to make Christmas closer. And what doesn't say Merry Christmas like a guy falling to his death? I love it. Some assembly required. It doesn't go onto its base. I hate it. I would like to say they gave no instructions on how to assemble this thing. Oh boy, I'm so excited to count down the days till Christmas. <laughs> Oh, he died. If Die Hard wasn't a Christmas movie, it is now. We got a 24 single serve teas advent calendar. I'm not a huge tea person, so I don't know why I bought this. Oh. I can't even open the doors on this one. It's just loose bags of tea. This isn't an advent calendar. Bottom, how dare you take away the one thing that brings me joy in life? How dare you? So I just have a bunch of loose tea bags now. I think I know what we're gonna do. All righty then, let's do this. All right, let's make some tea, ladies and gentlemen. Guys, look how good this is looking. <laughs> Next up, we got a Roblox advent calendar. I have never played Roblox in my life, but I will do whatever it takes to get my hands on a couple free Robux. Now, when I ordered this calendar, there were two different items on the Amazon listing, one that cost $50 and one that cost $65. In reading through the question and answer section, someone asked, what's the difference between the two? And the answer, the manufacturer says nothing. So which one did I buy? It's not called Sully Makes Poor Financial Decisions for no reason. See, this one has all the numbers in order because it's meant for literal children. Oh my gosh, it's a gingerbread man. Day two is just his legs, that's morbid. You gotta collect the limbs of your victim day by day, counting down the days till Christmas. Up, oh, I already broke it. I opened it three seconds ago and I've already broken it. Oh look, it's a rocket launcher. Merry Christmas everyone, nuclear Armageddon is almost here. Oh my God, it's a snowman and he has no head. Seven, let me guess, it's another snowman body part. I was right! The snowman head doesn't even go on the snowman body. This is stupid. Number nine. Creeper. Is this Minecraft? What's going on here? All right, upon further inspection, I think it's supposed to be a gift, but that straight up looks like a creeper. 13 is a narwhal, a Christmas narwhal. Merry Christmas, arf arf. I don't know what sound a narwhal makes. We're almost there, guys. Oh, you know, just another pair of legs. Wow. All right, I got a gift box. Ooh, there's a present in here. <gasps> it's empty. My disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. Oh my god, another weapon. What is it with Roblox? I had no idea Roblox was so violent. Why is there just a buff reindeer in here? All right, a reindeer scoot. All right, hold on. Reindeer can fly, right? Then why do they need a special reindeer scooter? I am writing a letter to Roblox Central for this discrepancy. How dare they? Wait till Rudolph hears about this. Oh my god, guys, it's Santa! My Christmas has been truly blessed. Although I'm sorry to hear about his legs. Ho, ho, ho. Merry poor financial decisions. Another weapon. I love I now have an arsenal of Roblox weapons. Fantastic. I don't think they included any Robux in this. I am disappointed. And last but certainly not least, it's 12 days of hot sauce. On the first day of hot sauce my true love gave to me. We got some sriracha, mango habanero. These all seem very generic. Chipotle hot sauce. Mmm. Poured myself a chicken burrito. Got some green chilies. Why is it wet? Extra hot. Now we got the skull and crossbones. We're getting into deadly territory. Habanero. Am I safe to assume this is the hottest one? Because it was last? So they don't list the Scoville units for any of these. So there's only one way to find out. That's number one? Wow, it's got some heat to it. I wasn't sure how hot these were gonna be, but they're actually pretty hot so far. Oh, I have a, I have a cut on my hand and the hot sauce just got on it. Ow! Oh, I did not like that one. Oh God, oh, that's the worst one so far. God, I need something to drink. 
Oh! Oh my god, I'm dying here. What I'm finding out here is I just don't like hot sauce. Oh my god. Oh no! Ah! We're almost done. Why do I do this to myself? You didn't ask- No one asked for this! Why did I do it? Is that the video? Are we done? Or have I successfully pigeonholed myself already and people expect a song with these videos? On the first day of Advent, my true love gave to me a strong batch of homebrewed iced tea. On the second day of Advent, my true love gave to me two fidget toys and a strong batch of homebrewed iced tea. I don't even like tea. Why On the third day of Advent, my true love gave to me three Bible verses, two squishy balls, and a strong batch of homebrewed iced tea. Ugh. On the fourth day of Advent, my true love gave to me Four bottles, oh my god. Too many Bible verses. <laughs> and a strong batch of homebrew iced tea. On the fifth day of Advent, my true love gave to me five Roblox men. Exodus 2020. Jesus Christ. And a partridge and a pear tree. Hey guys, look how big they grew. Oh, they grow up so fast. And that about wraps up the final video of the year, everyone. Thank you so much for joining this channel over the past couple of months. It has been great to see all of you enjoying the content. I hope you guys stick with me into the new year, and we'll see what kind of crazy things we can get up to. Merry Christmas and happy holidays. Be sure to spend some time with loved ones, family, friends, and until next time, be kind to one another, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace. Ah!